before we get today's video started, I had to show you guys my buddy's freshly wrapped Audi SQ5 in jumbo woodland camo. Ties right in with the bronze wheels. He also has those wrapped in an all-terrain tire. Looks so, so sick. You can hit a button to raise this thing up in off-road mode. Goes up like two or three inches. Diamond stitch interior. This thing is so sick. I don't know. Next car might be an Audi. We'll see. It's been a while since I've driven an Audi, but the last time I drove one, it was an A4. This thing is a little bit cooler than an A4. Really hope you guys can hear this right now. <laughs> Listen to this turbo flutter right now. <laughs> oh, that's sick. That's sick. I can get used to that. One thing Audi really has going for them is their precision handling and just how quick they are overall. But man, do you guys hear that? Oh man, this car would get me in so much trouble. Just like that, we're back in the Silverado. Fire this thing up. And we are on our way. So let's not hit these mirrors. Oh. Clear. Probably the only person here with a full-size truck in a one-car garage. That's all right. And here we are at the Tint Pros. Got to say what up to the boys one time. They're pulling like I own the place. Oh, what do we got back there? Silverado? Oh, he didn't. Oh, no, he didn't. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. No way. Like that. Really? Wow. Jeez. Hey, style. I didn't know he had it in him. You got the dance moves or what? You got the moves like Jagger, the moves like Danny over there? Come on, drop it like it's hot. Let's go. Hey, man, you know give, me, give me a little something. Come on. There it is. <laughs> you guys tended the 2500, right? Yeah. Well, let's go check it out. <laughs> Anything on the front windows? It's uh, 35 percent. 35 on the front, and then what? Five on the rear? No, the rear was 15 percent, but it already had a factory tint on it. Which, is, which was like uh, 35 percent. Right. So now it's like a limo. On top 15. Yep. It makes it a limo. So what did we do on my front window? Is that a 15? I believe. 15. That's 15 percent, right? Okay. To match with the back. Yep. Whose truck is this anyway? This one? <laughs> Man, I have no idea. I have no idea whose truck this is. Not a bad looking truck though, I must say. Matter of fact, I have a new antenna inside the truck. Do you guys have tools? The little, the little one. I got a twist. Oh. Psh. I bought the little stubby one, yeah, because this thing keeps hitting, it keeps hitting my garage ceiling, so. Look at that, it's too easy. Look at that, just like that. Bam. Let's pop that new one on. There we go, much better. Oh, you guys do it all, huh? Tim Pros also do antenna installs, so. Everything. Haul out your boys. That looks so much better. Way better. Well, also, do you guys have any tools to remove this air dam down here? This piece right here, I think it's a, uh, I wanna say it's probably some 10 mil bolts. I'm wearing a white shirt, so I'm not trying to get down and dirty, but seven down there? Yeah, seven. Oh, the okay. Your door panels, use yep. the same thing, same uh, size. Oh, perfect, okay, cool. Would you take the Silverado 2019 1500 or the 2500 HD, what year is this? 17? 16? Yeah. You, so you like this one better? You're not just saying that, right? Running boards or steps? So I get steps like these? It's good you know. for the passenger side because you know Kara does a little bit short. She's, yeah. she's five foot nothing. <laughs> Maybe five foot one. Either way, she would really appreciate some side steps. I removed the tubes off my canyon, remember? And it looked way better. I don't know, these kind of jack you of ground clearance too. <laughs> It is 12.39, you're right. You know what that means? It's time for a lunch. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Watch out for my switch. I still have to wire the thing in. Man, this truck, this truck is full of unfinished projects. That's for my rock lights. Oh. Yeah, I haven't wired it into the dashboard yet, but we'll get there. Look at Primo. Looks like he's on a date with himself. <laughs> Little table. Whoa, what is this thing? Mercedes A220? What? We are going to pick up sticks. Go inside for me and tell them you're Mark. Think they'll buy it? Okay. Are you Mark? Yeah, I'm Mark. Okay, all right. See you in a minute, Mark.
Primo. Primo. ¿Tú quieres carmel al palo? Simón, carajo. Simón. Órale, carmel. Oh, how perfect. It matches your shirt pretty much. <laughs> this was not this was not planned. This will be your third time changing it. I will probably change my bow tie color quite often. This looks so sick already. Out with the old, in with the new. That looks so sick. Oh, the new antenna. So much better. I'd have to agree. Okay, so I bought this tinted license plate cover. But I only have one, so should this go on the front or the back? The back, right? Oh, the back it is though. Oh, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. It's like hardly even that dark. We're out here at the Holy Gym Trail where they recently had the Holy Fires, which is pretty crazy. But we're gonna see what we can get into. Check it out. I'm getting rocked like a baby right now. I can, go to, I can go to sleep right now. It's how smooth this is. It's nothing, guys. All right, so we're getting a little a little bumpy, a little bumpy action going on here. Okay, still smooth. I'm still holding to my have my opinion on how smooth it is. Whoop. Yeah. You're not up two wheels yet. Okay, now you are. Definitely two wheels. Roll back. Yeah. No, don't do it. Look how big the flies are out here. That's crazy. What? Yeah, go outside. Ew. There's a bunch of flies out there, huh? Oh, sorry about that. He's struggling. Oh, he's struggling. I'm for sure not trying that. If the Jeep can't do it, I'm 35. I'm for sure. I'm for sure staying over here. That's a Rubicon, too. Okay, we might need four wheel for this one. Engaged. Play. Dude, these flies are massive. Get out of here. I don't know what you're contemplating right now, but leave. Are you in the ditch yet? No. Okay, let me know. No, not in the ditch. We're good? Mm. Clear? Yes. Good. You're good. Minor scuff, not too bad though. 
the rest looks good. Just a little, a little scuff right here. I was honestly expecting a whole lot worse. It's coming off anyways, so yeah, that'll uh, that'll be next. That's a solid two and a half inches right there, clearance. So, so I ordered a light bar for behind the grill, which will look really nice, even when it's off. So that's coming what this Friday, right? Mm -hmm. It's your Amazon account that I use, so. Friday. You have access to seeing when my stuff come. Got a 30 inch light bar coming really soon. Um, that diffuser in the front needs to come off. I think this looks super sick. You were saying my exhaust tip kept hitting the ground? Yes. No damage. The good thing is they're made to flex. Kind of feeling in and out. How about you? Mm -hmm. You down? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Well, on that note, we're off to in and out. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Till then, peace out.